Hey guys, how are ya? My name is Sound of a Gap and this is Mass Effect Andromeda. And we're back with Capote and his adventures in the Andromeda Galaxy. But before we continue, let's take a look at what happened previously. Dala, mother of. You always were a short-sighted fool. Helping an outsider instead of your own people. You're unfit to bear your family. <laughs> what an asshole! Finally I can say this in the game. Okay, this guy's really starting to piss me off. Just need to buy the rem tech piece off him so I can perfect my remnant scan. What was that? He and his crew keep showing up at sites we're targeting. It can't be coincidence. I think they could be following us somehow. Three of my brothers and sisters have joined the Roka. Okay, joining is different. Has poisoned them with his hatred of aliens. As far as everyone's concerned, the three sabers acted on their own. But they didn't, did mm -hmm. they? So I was right, wasn't I? Someone on the Nexus was helping the three sabers. Yes, it was a mistake. We authorized a course of action that cost lives. But, like I said... But you have to own up to it. To tell yes. People, if we made a mistake, we have to own it. Right? Correct. You are my new best friend. Ah, Ryder. I'd like to introduce you to my new best friend... What's your name again? <laughs> Sam Rick. All traffic and communication from the forge have stopped. It's under Arxul's control now. Damn it, but we need a way in. Come on. Any advice on how to get inside? My shuttle can drop you nearby, but that's about all I can do. Jaw, you sure you want me here? Bringing an outsider will give the Roka a different perspective. Just follow my lead. We'll get my family back. Yeah, of course. I take it the road car didn't want us going that way. How are we going to get to them now? We'll have to drop down. Really? And here's where Capote's adventure continues. That ain't jumpable. Use the rocks. Yeah. Okay. Uh. Well, let's just go down here. Okay. Use the rocks. Can I jump over from here? I should be able to make that jump, actually. I can't save it. Uh, okay. Let's go. Ha! Easy. Now what? Up the hill. Enemies. We got company. Sharpshooters. Keep your heads down. Axul must have sent reinforcements. Ah, great. Test them out. We can't let them reach the nest. They're shooting us like hijacks. Push to higher ground. Shit. Where is he going? Is he just standing there or is he behind that? He's behind that, damn it. Oh, there are, there's even more coming. Are you kidding me? Hmm. Shit. Come on, show yourself. I'm missing too many shots. Ooh, a saboteur. Two hits and you're dead. Damn it. There we go. Three more to go. One is over there. He is in cover. That one I... Oh! He just got out of cover. Get up. Shit. That was not a headshot. Come on. Three, two, and one. 
And one more. Question is, where is he? Hmm. Can't see him. Uh, okay. And it. Okay. It's beautiful. Hmm. Even Roka can't ruin this view. This stuff looks older than me. <laughs> Just wait till we get inside. That's really, that's really beautiful. Inside? There's a cave ahead. That's where the forge is. Okay. And hopefully where my family is. Oops, wrong button. Um Alright. These stones are massive. Mm -hmm. They were shaped from the very bedrock of Havaro. Using extreme heat. That's why we call it the forge. Ah, it's pretty here, I'll give you that. Do these markings mean something? Some think it is an ancient version of Shenesh, our trade language. But no one up that ledge. Yeah, I don't say. Sorry, I interrupted you, Jal. Uh, they don't even have weapons. Interesting. I count three. Wait! I know those voices. Lasu, go for backup. That's it. Uh, Lasu, wait. His brother. Stop. It's Jal. Jal, is that you? <laughs> yeah, correct. <laughs> ah, okay. <laughs> That's how you greet family. <laughs> Our mothers sent me. All of them. Did our mother send this human too? Uh, Sui, so you're Jal's sister. Hi. Uh, oh, yeah. No, let me introduce myself. I'm Ryder, Pathfinder with the Initiative. I should kill you right now. And Please. vice versa. Please. Why'd they send you? Because we've lost enough to the cat. They're afraid to lose you to this insane cause. But, Jal, I want you to meet my friend. So you can see that Aksul is wrong. Uh, we want peace? Yeah, I'm going for peace. We need to work together against the cat. We're here to stay. I want to get along. Who cares? The Angara don't want anything you have. We don't need you. Jal, our mothers want us to live. Truth it's because I love my mother that I will die for this Aksu cause. Is going to blow this place Let's up. Go. That's why I sent the researchers away. Really? Stop he has bombs talking. stolen from your people. Those bombs go off. It'll look like the initiative. Yeah. Did it. We have to disarm them. Who just? What? The own his own sister? Is she crazy? No, 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 no. The bombs in the forge. I'm okay, Jal. I'll be fine. Mm, let's go for this. You gonna make it? I hate Axul. Don't let him win. Wait. You hate him? You got Why it. are you working for him? I'm glad you're here. He could have stopped his own sister and brother. <sighs> Stupid. If Axul's willing to blow up the forge, there's nothing he won't do. Ryder. If he shows up. I know. Bob, I thought so. Your lead. Let's get started. I 
see you. Oh shit, this is Heimer. Ah, oh, fuck. Come on, Drake. Enemy shovel. Run, 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 run. Ah, shit. There's another one. On the left side. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, I need the sniper. This takes too long. Watch the pillars. Or we'll lose the fort trying to save it. <laughs> Dead. Who's shooting? And this guy. The bombs are halfway to detonation. Yeah, come on. Just two more to go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Quick, quick, quick. One more. Whoo. Jal. Jal. I killed that thought. I killed him. I'm so sorry. He's not dead. You are lucky. I lost my mind, Jal. I want to go home. But the cause, I joined because of you. I shot our brother. Don't leave Let me. Let her go. Axel. I only want soldiers who are committed to our cause. Our? It's yours. Not weaklings who stand by and watch the destruction of our people at the hands of aliens. He is so racist. Uh, your cause is corrupt, definitely. You recruit kids and make them fight their family. It's sick. And so are you. I speak for our people. And I say, you're done, oh Helios. <laughs> Martyr me. Please. I dare you. <laughs> you are sad and crazy. I'm going for this. <laughs> I don't kill unarmed crazy people. They move onto our planets. They take our resources. Make us That's not even true! I've watched Ryder make planets habitable. Exactly. And they'll never let us forget He it. rescued your beloved Morsai. I know. Saved her life. I know. Stop defending them. The Moshai trusts Ryder and stop. We've been fighting the wrong enemy. Maybe the enemy is this traitor. Who do you call a traitor? Jaw. Don't. The Moshai trusts Ryder. You've become a danger to your own people. Walk away. Or I kill you and reveal the resistance for the traitors they are. No! Damn it. Wait! This can't continue. We can't fight the Ket and each other. Please, listen. I had to kill him. Otherwise, he, he would have shot him. I'm sure he would. Yeah. You saved the forge. Many will be grateful. <laughs> Come on. Let's get you home.
building bridges. I'm so sorry, Lato. I never couldn't even kill me at short range. <laughs> Let's give them a minute. Aksul's death will strengthen the Rokar's cause. Really? I need to know, Ryder. Why didn't you trust me? Uh, this is actually true. I couldn't let him kill you, but I don't want to use this because I don't want to flirt. Um, it was too risky. Oh, actually, I'm sorry. Hmm. No, it was too risky. I wasn't going to let him kill a member of my squad. Even to prove a point. I just hate that we played right into his hands. This will mean bad things for my people. Mm. I should get back. I want to say goodbye before my family heads home. Hmm. Okay. Loyalty earned. Ryder has earned lo Jarl's loyalty. Jarl's rank 6 skills are now unlocked. Awesome! Very good. Great. So I think we are done here. Alright. Before we All before we go... Email check. Ah! You did the right thing from Lathul, Jarl's brother. Pathfinder. Whatever Jarl or anyone else says, I, for one, am thankful you killed Aksul. The things you could make people do. It's better that he's dead. Thank you, Lathul. That's good to hear. I like that. So, so we're gonna go here first, do this little Save Your Journeys mission. Uh, hopefully it's little. And then we'll go over here to Korra and do uh, to Korra's mission in the Valet system. Anomaly detected. Ah, okay. Starship wreckage. Stand by. I'm cutting through heavy interference from the scourge. We are pretty close for comfort. Something's drifting just inside. And Garn ship. In pieces. No life signs. Who did this? Cat? I found the ship's log. Scanning and downloading. Scavengers. The Angara caught them stealing satellites. The scavs fought back, and the Angara collided with the Scourge. Can we find the scavengers? I have their ship's transponder ID. It's registered out of Kadara port. Hmm, okay, so it looks like we have to go back to Kadara in just a bit. Uh, this this Angaran survey vessel suffered catastrophical, a catastrophic damage during a high-speed collision with the Scourge. Most wreckage remains trapped inside the anomaly. All right, travel to Kadara Port. Okay, let's do this before we go on. Defeat the satellite scavengers. Where are? Th oh, there they are. Okay. Approaching the scavengers that stole the Angoran satellites and destroyed the search vessel. What are the odds they'll surrender peacefully? Less than one percent. Oh, the big guy is coming too. Shit. Shit. Right at that moment, I wanted to shoot her, him. Well executed. Are there more coming? Yeah. Okay, we killed him. Up there. Shit. I'm 
missed him again. What? How can I not hit him? There we go. One more to go. Finally. Find the missing satellites. Okay. A shipping crate. Return to Mariko. I'll have the Tempest retrieve what's left for transport to Aya. No Angara here. Just our people. All right, let's return to Mariko in just a bit. Mariko, I'm back. You're always a welcome sight, Pathfinder. Thank you. Still no word from our search vessel. How goes your hunt for the missing satellites? Your people caught scavengers from Kadara port stealing them. There was a fight. Your ship lost. I sent them out. And risked your life, too. Hmm. The scavengers. Angaran? Have our deserters preyed upon us again? Uh, no, it was our people. They were from the Nexus. The criminals were my people. Exiles. They ripped your satellites into scrap. I brought what's left. The initiative is supposed to explore, not steal and kill. I know. Why would your people steal something that protects us all? Murder those who are only trying to help. Yeah, but we're not all that bad, but it's, it's complicated now. It's complicated. It's just an, it's just an awful answer. We are not all bad. These were a few bad people. There are thousands of good ones out there. How can we tell the difference? Hmm. Maybe the others are right. What if you are no better than the cat? Are you kidding? These scavengers abandoned the initiative, just like your deserters left. Correct. Them. And we hate them too. Keep what your people stole and go. I don't. I can't talk to you anymore. Well, that doesn't mean that I like what they did. Are you stupid? Sorry to hear things went south of that Angaran astronomer rider. Found a silver lining, though. The scrap satellites are going to come in extra handy. For what? Not as handy as what we could have had, but I'll take it. Uh, yeah. We're going to do this next, and then we're going to go to Eladen, most likely. So, what does she want? Uh, the Asari Ark, the Luzinia, Luzin is still missing. Given Korra's history with Asari commando commandos, she has spearheaded the effort to find the Luzinia and bring it home to the Nexus. Search the Valet system for Ark Luzinia. Let's do this. Not many signals out here. Even that random radio noise we get from the Scourge is quieter. Eerie. Mm hmm. All right. Yeah. There is an anomaly. Let's just go ahead and mark that. Probes launched. This is Cora's nav point. Okay, but before we go there, let's take a look at the other planets we see here and see what they are all about. Uh, let's start with Pass Sixteen. Pass 16 travels in a synchronous synchronous orbit around its sun, leaving one side always lit and the other always dark. The reason for this is unclear, but a threat of scourge within its path is suspect. Next one, all the way back here, Mazit. Platinum and Cobalt from form the outer layer of Mazit's surface, pitted and cracked by innumerable meteor strikes. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. Aluminum, a valuable light metal that is deposited is close to the surface and relatively easy to mine. Let's get some. 128, nice. Next. Fostan. Or Fostan. Fostan is largely barren, but its atmosphere is theoretically capable of producing rainfall. 
Powerful localized storms could appear as often as three or four times a year. What is this? Water? It's a river. A violent and recent rainstorm must have occurred to, cr occurred to create this river. The water will be absorbed or evaporated soon. Okay. And one more before we go on. Hippal. Much of Hippal's molten surface solidifies during the northern and southern hemisphere's short winters, reshaping the landscape every year. Ah, yeah. Okay. Now let's take a look at this signal. Uh, that's an extra mission? Okay, yeah, let's do that. We're approaching the nav points Korra found. Something's there. It might be an arc, but the damn scourge isn't helping. Sam, help out with sensors. Hard to believe the Lucinia could survive in all this. Mm, let's be positive. Come on. Focus on how we can help them. Good call. Help Asari, piss off the cat. Very cathartic. <laughs> Sarissa will have plans for those decimation hunters. Wrote the manual on crisis situations. The commando you mentioned. You still believe she'll save the day? Sarissa was a legend even before she was the Pathfinder's bodyguard. She'll have a plan. Aha! Detecting an initiative vessel. Reading life signs. And minimal power. Multiple hull breaches. She's a wreck. But intact. If she's spaceworthy and her crew's alive, that's all we need. Callow, take us in. I'll try. Must be one docking bay still holding together. Oh, that's gonna be interesting. This could be actually a longer mission. Reach the bridge, yeah, we will have to maybe fight our way through here as well. So let's go. We're aboard. Any response to comms? Nothing. Maybe their sensors are busted. Here's the fight. There has to be a fight. What a mess. But it look no space battle. Ah, oh, that looks like the Nexus. They had borders. It's built the same way like the Nexus. Come to bring you home. Beginning decompression. Die, you cat monsters. We're not cat, we're a Pathfinder team. Ryder, Lieutenant Harper, and Sam, just send her our ident codes. Confirmed. Sorry. <laughs> I'm Captain Atondra, but what's left of the Lucinia. Come up to the bridge. Maybe you can help fix this mess. I hope so. This definitely looks exactly like the Nexus. Area saw combat action. Nobody. The crew complement. Bridge crew two of seven. Maintenance crew zero twenty. Security medical. Oh, there's only two on the cr the bridge, and the rest is gone. Caution. Key systems critically understaffed. Advice against civilian status revi revival. Advice immediate revival of vital personnel. Override author authorization. Theris. Comment families first. Sam. Override confirmation. Sam, Lucinia, comment immediately. Pathfinder. Whatever happened left the captain a little trigger happy. If the tempest looked like this, how would you feel? What else can we find here? Sales report Lucinia. Power distribution efficiency 9%. Drive core offline. Life support function 83. Critical damage report deck 12. Maintenance and hull impacts. Oh my god. Maybe we should just take the people that, who are here and go back home with them to the Nexus. It doesn't look like we can actually uh, restore this ship. But you'd vent a Pathfinder team into space? Respectfully, yes. We can't take any more chances. 
<clears throat> Sarissa Theris, Pathfinder. Don't mind the captain. Scolding me eases her blood pressure. <laughs> uh, Cora's your biggest fan. Yeah, let's go on that. Cora here thought the famous Sarissa would have everything in hand. I thought Matriarch Ashara was Pathfinder, ma'am. And you were her bodyguard, like her Tiamna. I served with the Sari Commandos, ma'am. Memorized all your battle manuals. Matriarch Ashara is dead. Really? Sarissa was next in line. Her battle manuals haven't kept the cat off my ark. All right, uh, we are here to save you. That ends today. We'll see your ark safely back to the Nexus. I hope so. We've tried everything else. Matriarch Ashara died trying to negotiate with those Ket bastards. So I took something precious from them, too. What did you take? I stole a module containing tactical data. All their secret routes through this phenomenon. We call it the Scourge, ma'am. If we could outmaneuver the Ket through it... We'd stand a better chance against them. Their Archon had the same thought. He sent his elite agent, the Valiant, and his decimation hunters after us. Hmm. We take more damage each time we escape the Valiant. The last assault? He sent forces to board us. Sarissa's theft has made things problematic. Wait, they are still cut on board? How many borders are we talking about? We're not sure, but for now, they're contained down there. We couldn't do more. We spent our resources evacuating civilians. The Valiant wants Sarissa to pay. Hmm. Well, nah, she did her job. I didn't. I wouldn't say it was stupid. I like what she did. Pathfinders have to take risks, Captain. I've taken my share. The goddess preserve me. What would it take to get the Ark out of here before this Valiant catches up again? An FTL burn long enough to lose him. But since the evacuation, we've been stuck at minimal power. The drive core is dead. My people are investigating, but those systems are below deck, with the Ket borders. Hmm. Another Pathfinder team could back them up. Get power for the drive core. My Sam and I will finish deciphering the Ket data. We'll turn the Valiant's escape routes against Cool. Them. The Ket will suffer. I promise. The last commando report came from hangar control. I'll give you access. Please be careful. Okay, so we will have to fight Ket now. Ride the tram to hangar control. Oh, we're already in it. Uh huh. You okay, Cor? Pathfinders take risks. They really do. Matriarch Ashara, your father. We roll the dice and. Hey, sometimes we win. Come on. The sooner we find those commandos, the better. I would say most of the time you win. Look for Asari Commandos in Hangar Control. Oh, that looks like we will have to fight here first time. On this ship. Was it this quiet when the Arcs were traveling through dark space? Hangar Control Maintenance Log. Uh, ergonomic adjustment installed, driver update, blah blah. Override for hangar door access, override of launch permissions. Got a dozen escape pods launched today. Launch is complete, reinstalling hangar door access, investigate, repeat. Not a false alarm, seal all doors, seal all, and then it's over. Imagine centuries of dark silence. Alone. Shit. The Lucenia will be back to normal once we get her to the Nexus. Here we are. Hangar control. Okay. No, definitely not. Must be part of Sarit. Stop. In the name of the goddess, I'll Hello. Shoot your rescuers. <laughs> rescuers? And humans? Your arc made it? Just about. I'm Ryder, the human pathfinder. This is my team. I'm Vidaria Damali, Sarissa's new second in command. Sorry about the mix up. I hope I can help. Yeah, we need power for the arc. The captain says we need to restore power to go to FTL. Right. Yes. I've tracked the power drain, and I think shutting the hangar bay doors will fix it. The cat forced the doors open, and the safeties are draining power trying to shut them. Okay. Uh, by the way, I think FTL stands for faster than light. Um, 
Yeah, Sam can help us, probably. Don't worry. My Sam can probably override whatever the Ket did. Ket can survive in vacuum for a little while. If we shut the doors, the Valiant's pet hunters lose their last escape route too. Cool. I pray the power will be enough for FTL. I just... What? Vidaria, I served as a huntress. Remember Sarissa's manuals. Breathe, purpose, action. Breathe. <sighs> okay. Who is breathing like that? Let's take a look at the console. I'll keep watch. Active, activate hangar door override. Now we're gonna have to fight in just a bit. Starting hangar door closure sequence. Okay. Yeah, I thought so. You've got this. Where? Cover the console while Sam works. Nice steady fire. Yes, ma'am. Come on. Stupid dog. Hangar door closure at twenty one percent. Come on. Let me shoot your face. Let me shoot your face. Another one up there. Okay. Hunger door pressure at fifty three percent. next up there Get down and the doors are closed and locked Why is he going and down? Oh, come on. This is so stupid. Talk to her. Something just happened. What was that? I estimate that several of the arc's electrical junctions just overloaded. Shit. Shit. Vidaria? Vidaria, Sam says we lost some electrical junctions. I know. The overload started a fire. Damn it, that shouldn't have happened. Be calm, soldier. What could have made him overload? If there's something else draining power on the lower decks, uh, something big. Okay, it could be cat sabotage, maybe. Hmm. Maybe the decimation hunters rigged something up. I wouldn't put it past those wretches. Those cats. They must be watching us. If they delay the repairs long enough, the Valiant ship catches up. Okay, how can we distract them? Can we flash some lights, make some noise, get the kid off our backs? Well, splitting up would give them two targets, right? Okay. First thing is the last stasis pods. I'll go check on them. You could go below, look for whatever's draining power, and maybe help with the fire. Okay, let's do this. Way to the lower decks. Uh, the living quarters. I'll open maintenance access. You can cut through. Good luck. May the cat wither in the void before you. So where do I have to go now? Go below decks through the living quarters. Okay. We got some power, then a damage report. What happened? An accident. We're fixing it. All right. Go forward. We'll keep prepping the drive core. We won't let you down, ma'am. Of course not, Lieutenant. Sirissa out. Okay, I can't go through there. Let's go here. Wait. Vidiri here. I'm almost at the 
stasis pods? Ah, blast. There's no power for elevators. Vidaria, cut the elevator's mag locks. If the arc's like ours, you can climb down the shaft. Good idea. Here. Thanks, ma'am. Okay. What's happening to Ark, Lucinia, uh, all from Sarissa? You are out of stasis because you were needed on deck early. Unfortunately, you now need to attempt to a very, uh, to adapt to a very different scenario that, than was expected. To avoid rumors spreading, this is the situation. We are under attack by a hostile species. Diplomatic over overtures were rejected and will not be repeated. Regrettably, our matriarch Ishara died attempting negotiations. I have reluctantly taken on her role as Pathfinder, but cannot replace her. We must deviate from our intended course and attempt to lose the enemy before our rendezvous with the Nexus. With Captain Atandra's approval, I've authorized a, gener a general evacuation order as we revive civilians. Meanwhile, commando forces in our survey ship, the Parafona, will perform necessary diversion diversionary actions. I will not understand I will not understate the seriousness of, of our position. I won't un underestimate your skills either. I have faith in you. Theris. Regrets. For the last time, I'm not shutting up. I went to sleep, dreaming of new worlds, and woke to fire and screaming, and people huddled in dormitories. And they won't let us back into stasis. We are supposed to just crash land on a barren planet in some teeny escape pod like it's that's going to be better? I want what was promised, what I gave them my money and my life for, and I'm not going to stop trying to get answers. Yeah, I think I would be pretty much uh, overwhelmed as well. Another reason to bring down retribution. That doesn't sound good. Ah! <laughs> Fucking hell! <laughs> Stupid dogs! Got aboard. Fuck! The children left. Every time! Every fucking time! <sighs> Someday I will get a heart attack because of those beasts. Fideria again. Two cat were trying to mess with the stasis pods. Not anymore. Good work. Remember Sarissa's manual. Stay low. I will. The pods are safe. I'll keep tracking that power drain. Looks bad. Why isn't the fire suppression system engaged? Either insufficient power, or the explosion damaged fire control. We could fix that if we find the controls. And then reach whatever's draining power without getting singed. It's Vidaria. The cat saw me. I am trapped in an air vent. Ready your biotics, and pick the them off as they pass. But they'll hear. You're a huntress, a silent predator. Okay. I saw it. Okay, that one is dead. When I bet I should do first. Okay. Up there. Alright. Uh this one. Okay, actually, let's go for the sniper. Nice. Shit! Shit! The cat were after the fire suppression control. Over there. <sighs> ah. Yeah, that's right. Fuck. Ironic. The electrical junction is damaged. I recommend searching for an alternative. Of course. Scan for a way to route power to the fire suppression system. Yeah, it's back here. This is obvious. Can't see a way to Reactivate the fire suppression. The arc needs fire control more. There. Let's try again. Nice. 
That should cool us off. Videri again? I got the Ket. They got me back, but I'm okay. Nice work. And with the hangar shut, I managed to track the real power drain. Here's the nav point. I'll see you there. Alright, meet Vidaria. Guys, get out of my way. Move it. 